Let's look at other news now and as the dry weather continues to persist in the country, forest fires have been on the rise in different parts of the country. At the Abadea National Park, much of the fire has been contained with the officers carrying out a mopping exercise to put out any remaining fires that have left over 40,000 acres in ashes, while in the Mao, 1,450 acres have been raised with officers working to contain the inferno. At the Mau Forest, fire has raised over a thousand acres of forest land, according to Daniel Shimatwa, the Narok County Forest Conservator. Over 100 officers have been deployed to contain the fire. 1,450 acres, <coughs> and the fires are still raging as I speak. My people are on the ground at a place called uh, Ngobe. They are trying, struggling with the fires. The fires are fought in the morning. And in the, the officer explaining that forest fires could have a lasting effect on the environment and if left unchecked, Kenyans could feel the effect. And uh, if this area is, is left uh, to be destroyed by the fire, then the repercussion will be felt far and wide. We know the rivers, the main rivers, the 12 rivers that flow from the mouth. And others. According to Shimatwa, human activities are to blame for the fires and is calling on locals to be more conservation oriented. Uh, so it's just a general appeal to the public that let's participate in this forest fire fighting. And in the Abadea National Park, small fires are still raging as ground troops work to contain the fire that left over 40,000 acres burned with a sky surveillance team leading the efforts to contain the fire. Martin Monene, Citizen TV.